It seems like only yesterday when we had Blender 3, now we have 3.2 in Alpha. So do you need to rush over and download it? Well, maybe this short video will help you decide. So if you didn't already know, Blender 3.2 is now in Alpha, which means that Blender 3.1 is in Beta. What does that all mean for the ordinary Blender hobbyist or even aspiring professional? Well, for the most part, you don't have to rush out and download the new version as nothing huge and major is happening. There are speed improvements in lots of different things, including cycles, so perhaps we're it if you desperately need that power. There are improvement and updates on things like Grease Pencil, the video editor, animation nodes, but generally they're in fairly advanced areas so it won't make too much difference to the average user, so don't feel like you're missing out just yet. If you've got a new Mac with one of those lovely M1 processors, there's the metal integration so you should see some big improvements in render speeds. Now Blender 3.0.1 is just around the corner and that has some bug fixes so will definitely be worth downloading and using for everyone. Let me know what you're excited about and happy blending.